Deputies arrest a DCF worker accused of living inside a filthy home filled with drugs and counterfeit money, along with six children. Washington's Gail Pasco brown is live outside the Osceola County Sheriff's Office. And Gail, this woman who's assigned to protect children is now charged with child neglect. You're exactly right, Jim. And now her children are in DCF custody. Now, uh, Osceola County Sheriff's deputies have been watching their house for quite some time for suspected drug use. They suspect it was more for use rather than any trafficking is concerned. We were in court today during the children's shelter hearing. Is there anything you want to say in your defense? Nothing at this time, ma'am. My attorneys will deal with it. Randy Donawa had little to say as he entered court for a shelter hearing for his children. He and his wife were arrested Friday for drugs and child neglect. Their six children, ages 17 to 6, the youngest a girl, are in child protective custody. These are pictures taken from the couple's Hollyhock home in Kissimmee, where 26 pot plants, counterfeit money, and a handgun were seized. Investigators say the house smelled of urine and was extremely dirty. In the bedroom where the 12, 9, and 8-year-olds slept, deputies saw several cockroaches and feces along with rotten food on the floor. In the kitchen, the arrest report says there were various chemicals on the ground, some in open containers, dishes covered with flies, roaches, and rotten food. The report goes on to say that roaches and uncleanliness were so grotesque, the entire family's health could have been negatively affected. Kaiser Donoa was a DCF Child Protective Investigator in 2002 for four months, and she left voluntarily. As recently as May 2nd, she was training as an investigator for the agency. It's extremely disappointing. Um, we hold our employees at a very high standard. Um, the fact that she's in training and has previously investigated child abuse and neglect cases, and she's being charged with the same, and it's just incredibly disappointing. Now, the judge awarded temporary custody of the Donawa children.